Thank you for joining. I have a message from the Government of Canada. As you are aware, the recent election results revealed a divide between Alberta and the rest of Canada. We are also aware of various groups calling for the separation of Alberta from Canada. And no, it's not just BC who wants that. In an effort to begin to heal this national lesion, or saddle sore, as our friends in Calgary would say, the government of Canada is taking great steps to ensure that Alberta knows, and all of Alberta, not just the good-looking bits like Banff, that it is an important and beloved part of Canada. I will now uh, outline the government's step-by-step -step plan to show Alberta that Canada's love for it is just like the oil and gas industry itself. Currently fine. Step one. The rich history of the West Edmonton Mall will now be taught to all Canadian school children. Of course, the West Edmonton Mall is North America's biggest shopping mall. It is a utopian vision of what Canada could be if it was governed by Jean, sorry, Jean Machine and Le Chateau in 1987. Some say it can almost make you forget that you're in Edmonton if you try hard enough. Step two, Canada will henceforth have three official languages, English, French, and Calgary's, the language spoken by the people of Calgary. For those in other parts of Canada looking to learn how to speak Calgary's, just drop the G off of any word ending, sorry, ending in ING. Like heartwarming, handshaking, liberal party hating. You get the idea. Step three the drink invented in Alberta, the Caesar, will officially replace all four former food groups. Step four. Referring to Edmonton as the Mississauga of the Prairies will be strongly discouraged. Step five. As you may be aware, the city of Lloydminster straddles the Alberta-Saskatchewan border and is Canada's only bi-provincial city. To celebrate and officially recognize this, Canada will now refer to LGBTQ plus as LGBTQ plus Lloydminster. The government of Canada hopes that these decisive and some might say wild rose actions. No, is no one saying that? Okay. We hope that these actions will help convince Albertans that they are indeed a beloved and important part of our nation. Thank you. No questions.